years. So we're underway with the first of the semi-finals. Toda Miri and uh, Charlene Van Snick. She's in the under 48 kilo category. I'm not sure what uh, weight Ya Ting is, but maybe a bit heavy, uh, maybe a little bit heavier yeah. than, than this pair. We'll come to your weight in a couple. <laughs> okay. Just enjoy the game. on the board already for Van Snick from that first attack. Van Snick looking to go uh, left-sided there. She went for the leg from the ground, so that's going to be okay. Couldn't uh, attack the legs direct with the hand if she was standing up. If she was on the ground, and uh, not a problem with that. She goes right-sided against the um, Japanese. And now a chance to work on the arm. Toda Miri needs to stand up here. And she does. Getting close to getting that uh, arm lock on then. So uh, Toda's going to be have, have to be careful. She's good at uh, Osai Waza. Those are holes. But maybe she's not uh, that sharp yet on her arm locks and strangles. Nick looking to go left-sided there. So too, Toda Miri. And now a chance to work on the ground. Needs to keep her on, down on the ground. But that's not the best position of the referee calls Mate and stands them back up. Over three and a half minutes to go. It's the Belgian who leads by Wazari. Neither, neither player able to make an opening on the ground. That Snick had the first chance when she tried to um, put on the uh, Concepcion was against Toda, but uh, she missed out. That was a rather uh, sloppy attack from that Snick. Throwing, attempted to throw on the wrong side, and Toda now looking to uh, get past the legs. Got the head trapped. Oh. That head trap, she really wasn't going anywhere, and the uh, referee had no choice but to call Mate. Just over three minutes left to go, a little over three minutes. And again, uh, that Snick looking to come off that uh, left side. Toda hasn't really settled yet, she's um, been one step behind all the time, and Van Snick is the, uh, the first to attack. Just a little bit watchful, the young Japanese at the moment, just 20 years old. Oh, so young. A little bit of a stalemate now, as Toda just, you can almost see her trying to work it out and think what she's going to come with, come to attack uh, Van Snick. There's plenty of time left on the clock. 2.23 left to go. That single score is what separates uh, the pair at the moment. Good change of direction from uh, Van Snick. She got caught there, though. She walked onto that, and Yuko on the board now for Toda. So the scores are tied up, and Yuko apiece. And uh, and Snick almost climbed onto Toda's back, and went over pretty easily in the end. Trying to get herself um, worked up. Uh, Kiai, the shout from um, and Snick. I beg your pardon, from Toda to try and. Uh, generate some excitement. The scoreboard has come into operation. That was blank for a while, but uh, full, full swing now. Minute 45 left to go. And Snick attacking both left and right. Uh, Toda 
it's still not up to the pace, really. Just needs to make sure that she uh, keeps up her rate of attack so that she doesn't fall behind and pick up uh, a passivity warning. She's already been warned once. That's that little yellow card that you see next to the number one. Or another one, and she'll give up a score. She won't want to do that. Minute 19 left to go. Muscle her way past um, Toda there, but nothing came of it. It's amazing to think that Toda must be uh, ranked number six in Japan. Five fighters ranked higher than her in Japan. Here she is in the uh, semi-final of the Grand Prix, battling it out with um, people in the top ten in the world ranking list. Just to show the depth that there is in um, Japanese light. Sneak looking to go uh, left-sided, again this time with the Sode Tsuri, with her right wrist heavily strapped causing uh, some discomfort missed with the uh, Uchigari there. Toda looking to... Uh, that's going to be the end of it because she won't have long enough to uh, pull a score back, I don't think. And, uh, very little time left now for Toda to pull this back. Tries to go left-sided, but it's, uh, it's a hurried bubble van snake. Misses completely with the hands and uh, won't have enough time now. And it's um, Charlene Van Snick, the number one seed. Huda takes the uh, bronze medal uh, automatically. Uh, bronze medalists. So it's the Belgian into the uh, final. And we're going to find out 